So, there we are. What are we doing here? Trim well, this is what we have to do. Helen, I, I planted these trees and they're really not in the right spot, but we're gonna deal with them. And every year we end up with these little suckers and little sprouts, and it just makes the tree look unattractive. So fortunately you're here to cut off all the little ugly bits for me. Does that include this whole thing? Yeah, I think that yeah. bit should go. So I'm just gonna come in and just, so that people can see what you've got. You've got a nice pair of secateurs there. These yes, are my yes. Felco number twos, and I, I really do like these. They oh, Swiss I, made. I, well, only the best. Only the best. Okay, so, so right into the edge, you said. Axel, that's it. Like that, and then right into the edge, and then snip down. There you go. You've done a very good job. So if you could. Is that close enough? Well, you know what? You'll, you're just going to get better and better at this. Okay. Because we certainly have enough to cut here. And we'll pick them up afterwards, Pick right? them up after. Okay. There we are. Now, word to the wise, always step back. Because what happens is you start to get really enthusiastic about this uh -huh. and you can end up making a plant look very odd. Bold. So, So, yes, <laughs> so I always have this rule that after you've cut five or more things, that you stand back and just look. And just look. Done. Okay. Okay. So let's figure out what we might do next. Okay. I've got now. There are some little sprouts at the bottom. Perhaps we could take those off. You mean these? The little down a little these? bit further. Yeah. Okay. Just grab those guys. This is actually growing out of the ground at the bottom of the tree. Yeah. Well, that's that's fine. We'll just we'll take those out. They're probably coming off a root. Well, is that off the tree as well? Oh, uh, no, that, that looks... something else. Yeah, that's something else. Now, you see, this is the problem with newbie gardeners, Barbara, letting them loose on your, on your garden. Something... Well, I could make a wee mistake here and cut the wrong thing. Well, not to worry. I tell you, it's, it's worth it having someone help you out. <laughs> okay, that's all these ones down from down there. Okay. You know, Helen, sometimes when the little sprouts are small, you don't have to use any tools at all. You can just rub them off with your fingers. Okay. Oh, yeah, look, there they go. Yep. Oh, no, this is very cool. It's working quite well. It is. There they were. They were there before, now and you now... See it. Now you don't. That's it. Now, we're just getting rid of these just for aesthetic purposes, eh? Exactly. If they were to fill in, the, the bush would... It's not the look I want. Uh -huh. So it's sort of hairy, isn't it? Well, yes. <laughs> Her suit. Her suit, yeah. There. Perfect. These ones too? Absolutely. Wherever you don't want a branch, because they would just be little nubbly little branches. Uh -huh. Not good looking. Oh there we go. These are coming off nice. Oh look, here's a big one now. Yeah. We have to get with the snake towers again. Perfect. Well done. Thank you, Helen. I'm just going to go with this one. 